my name is anil nayar and i strongly believe that in competitive examination it is not about your mathematical and your verbal skills that will be tested any student who is good in reading and reasoning skills will have an edge over the student who is just good in reproducing the formulas and getting the answers in this video i am going to help students to solve aptitude problems through a cube they have never seen before if i take two numbers m1 is 4 and 2 is 6 highest common factor will be 2 lcm will be 4 and 6 it will be 12 so 2 into 12 equal to 4 into 6 so most of the textbooks do this mistake n1 into n2 equal to l into h they will write but see here is 2 a factor of 4 yes is 4 a factor of 12 yes that means 2 should be a factor of 12 is yes or no yes. that means this is valid only when hcm is a factor of lc is only valid when hcm is a factor of lc right now this first concept don't blindly use that formula this is used only when hcm is a factor of lc concept to is it also also valid when there are three numbers that also we will discuss there we will use the concept when uh, how to write the numbers as a product of four prime that also we will discuss hopefully i'll answer the question in the next half an hour concept 2 concept 2 see here n1 equal to 12 n2 equal to 18 12 twel is nothing but 2 square into 3 18 is nothing but 3 square into 2 so lcm lcm of 12 comma 18 It is nothing but 36. 36 is 2 square into 3 square. So what is LCM? LCM always takes the highest power of the highest power of the given prime bases. LCM always takes the highest power of the given prime bases. LCM always takes the Highest power of the given prime bases. LCM always takes the highest power of the given prime bases. Example: N one equal to two cube into three power four into seven square. N two equal to two power six into five square into seven power four. LCM of LCM of n1 n2 will be 2 cube 2 power 6. What is highest? 2 power 6. 3 power 4. 5 square. 7 power 4. LCM always takes the highest power of the given prime bases. First question. LCM of 6 power 6. 8 power 8. Comma n equal to 12 power 12. Generally in our textbooks, few numbers will be given. We have to find the LCM. Now I gave the LCM. We have to find out how many values n can take. How many values n can take? How many values n can take? LCM of 6 power 6, 8 power 8, n is 12 power 12. How many values n can take? Now see here. First question I solve. First decompose the number into prime bases. Two power six into three power six. Eight power eight is two power twenty-four. Mm -hmm. N we don't know, but we know the LCM to be twelve power twelve. Twelve will be two square into three power twelve. So this will be two power twenty-four into three power twelve. Listen carefully. LCM always takes the highest power of the given prime bases. 2 power 24 is present in the answer. It 
it should be present in one of the three numbers. Already 2 power 24 is present. So it will take any value from 0 to 24 because 2 power 6, 2 power 24, 2 power 0. What is highest? 2 power 24. 2 power 6, 2 power 24, 2 power 24. Still highest. 3 power 12. It should be present in one of these three numbers. Not present here, not present here. It should be present in third number. So n will be 2 power 0 into 3 power 12, 2 power 1 into 3 power 12 and so on up to 2 power 24 into 3 power 12. 0 to 24. How many values? 25 values. 25 values. I hope the idea is clear. Even if LCM is given for a set of numbers, you can find what are the values that number can take. So, idea clear? Second one. LCM of second question. LCM of 12 power 12, 12 power 12, 256 power 9, comma x equivalent to 24 power 24. What is the maximum value x can take? LCM of 12 power 12, 256 power 9. Same approach, 12 power 12. 12 power 12 will be, 12 will be 2 square into 3 power 12. So this will be, 2 power 24 into 3 power 12. 256 power 9. So this will be 2 power 8 power 9. So this will be 2 power 17. X. We don't know the value of X. But the answer is 24 power 24. This will be 2 cube into 3 power 24. So this will be 2 power 72 into 3 power 24. 2 power 72 should be present in any of these three numbers, already present in second number. So x will take anything from 0 to 72. 3 power 24 is not present, so it will be present in third number. What is the maximum value of x? Maximum value of x will be 2 power 72 into 3 power 24. Thank <laughs> you.